and welcome to our channel. It's Devon the Goddess 717. And I got great news, guys. As you guys saw the video, if you missed it, uh, we have both platforms up and running. So what is going to happen now, guys, is the new channel, we're up, we're going to release the video. The first premiere will be here. Okay, this is what I, what God told me to do it to get you guys back moving the oil machine here for both channels. Okay, so we are going to have four videos a week, um, for each channel. Okay, so you'll get two videos a night, four days a week, and you still still get your four extended readings for the Patreon loves. You'll still get that, but we are going to do the Patreon. Um, the extended will be off of the old channel, so therefore I'm getting you guys what well, you're used to. So we'll do our first premiere here. And then I'll tell you guys to meet me over on the other channel. So that we'll do the extended off of that channel for our final reading for the night, okay? So that way we are getting both channels up and moving for what God is planning for us to have coming next. So we are now up and running. If you guys have not subscribed to either channel, the button is below. I got it built nicely for you guys um, up under the description box of every video on either channel, okay? Um, but the... Link will be under this video and up under the one for tonight. So you guys will know for sure, okay? I have a button with my with the hand pointing. It says first channel, click link up under the, up under the hands. And then it says new channel, link up under the hands, okay? You can click, subscribe, and do your notification bell so you guys will not miss out. I don't want you missing messages because we're doing, I'm going to, every day that I have one on the new platform, I will have one on the old platform as well, okay? The ex, the extended reads will be off of the old platform because I want you guys to get used to getting the new, the old platform back in the process of the cycle, okay, our routine. So we're going to start here first on the new channel and then we'll be going over to the old channel after this, okay? So let's get started, all right? You guys will have two shorts too. You'll have two daily messages. A day okay one for the old one for the new so you guys will not know you like dag what happened i'm on both platforms now i don't want you guys to miss out okay we have you get two readings a day plus your extended reading if you're patreon and on tuesdays you'll get four readings okay with the 144k chat membership okay that's what we got let's get started for so for this reading here we'll talk about everything else at the end Whew, we have karmic retribution okay so there is karma coming down for whatever, whoever was stealing people's mates and um, connections. with They had a lot of magic and spell work tied to it. There is a lot of backfire happening right now. The overall energy is desire, self-pleasure, self-thought, sexual thoughts, and intense feelings. Somebody, um, somebody's awakened. Mm -hmm. And they know the truth. This person, whoever this this um part this karmic that's getting their retribution, their karma, this love spell person here, this person used sex magic and love spells to make this person want to be with them. They played on their lust. Okay, this was somebody who was in their lustful energy here. So this person got a serious karmic lesson as a person in, in natural form. Okay, the, which means this person was a player. They went into a karmic love relationship, which was actually a situation ship. It was a false connection. It was not real. It was an illusion. Okay. Everything is shattering with the overall energy here. This person is coming unhooked. There's some type of breakup or separation happening, or it has already happened, or is in the process of, ha or is about to happen after the tower falls. Okay. Block communication. This karmic will be blocked out. Yes. Everything is reversing here. Mm hmm. Because God's design is what he allowed this person to hang themselves. And they're hung by the leg where they cannot move. This person is being shown for the fraud that they are. Everything is going backwards in this situation. We have spells. The spell work, love magic has gone back. It's reversed. Which also means that this person is also crazy. Um, because they're receiving everything back that they put out. This karmic love was not real. It was a situation ship. Okay. This connection was false. It had no nothing. It was nothing but a lesson for this person to learn. Uh huh. This person is. It always went back to this person. They did many cycles in this connection, but this time it's a solid no. Yep. This person knows losing you was their karma. They're stuck on trying to what get find a way to get your forgiveness. Okay. This person wants to come and ask you for your forgiveness. They've learned their lesson. Uh huh. 
and they want there's some type of incoming message coming in for them to talk to you that's what we got here yep so this is some type of thing that's coming right back around the apologies that you guys are waiting on the reason why it was not happening is because somebody was in a karmic cycle that they had to learn a lesson in whenever whenever god holds somebody back in a karmic cycle it's because it's for your highest good and theirs this person needs to know your worth whoever this is had to learn a lesson yeah and they learned it and this person is crazy hot for you they have very much and they're and not it's not just sexually as intense as far as their feelings as a whole because this situation here they were suppressed in a connection that was not for their highest good it was not really a real connection their feelings for this person was not real they were not in love with this person that it was all spell work love magic love bombing love spells sex magic all type of magic here mm-hmm Yep, it's even like, you see how the baby on there? It's even kids that are not theirs, too. Could be a little boy or a little girl or whichever it is. But on here, this, you see the baby looks nothing like that man, okay? It's a situation ship here. Yep, and it's coming to the forefront. What we got here, Father? Let's get started. Whew, wow. What is um spell work? Yep, it was false. It was all a lie. Page of Cups. The situation was a fraud. It was not real. We're going to pull this back so we can see what's going on here. I'm going to get all of this in here. Yes, we're going to get all of that in there. What well, is love magic? is in reverse. It's a lot of fighting. Conflict. What did I say? This is love magic. The situation is exposed. Yeah. These towers are coming down with these fraudulent people. These karmics are very desperate people. Um, they do whatever they can to keep a person tied. But they, didn't, they, they are... The thing that you know their mental patience is because... Um, for you to feel and believe that you are higher than God and that God is not watching, he sits high and looks low, okay? He don't always speak. He don't always say. He sits back and he lets you noose yourself. This person is noosed. They can't move. They've been exposed to everyone. So whatever lies and manipulation and pain that was caused between you and this person, or if this is someone that's coming towards you with, as a, a, a past life soulmate that's coming in as a new person, this is what's ending going on in their life behind the scenes. If this is someone you've been with because of forgiveness here, this person here, they were noosed in this connection with this person. They were strong held. Mm -hmm. This person, they, they basically deboed them to be with them. What's the karmic love here? This is not somebody this person would like. It's not even their type. It's not somebody they would want. What did I say? The karmic love is, is this person's losing their mind. I just said it. Because all the spell work is going back on this person here. This karmic. Mm -hmm. This person is very much in love with your person because of all the spell work that they did to them so this person is, is um they're going through some serious backfire here karma retribution this person's being punished mm-hmm in their mental space in their life um they this person's in love they're gonna they're gonna die with in love with this person their karma will be to be in love with this person while your person come back towards you this person will always be in conflict when it comes to love they will not receive the, this person will never receive any love here this situation ship, living relationship. This person committed to this person. They they forced them to commit to them or marry them. And this was a situation ship. You were the actual commitment. You were the actual queen of pentacles here. This person was a counterfeit in this connection. They caused all this chaos and drama between you and this person because everything was spell work here. Wow. Wow. Is that something? People are desperate. Mm -hmm. And this person here thought that this situation was going to play out. They thought it was going to continue to play out, that they would get away with it. And it did not work out in their favor. Mm -hmm. What is no? Yep. Yep. This person's coming out of this energy. Whoever this is, they, this, okay, let me tell you something. And whoever your person is, if they kept repeating, when you guys are saying, well, why they keep going back? Why they keep going back? It's spell work, y'all. When you guys say that, that lets me know that you don't know nothing about spiritual warfare, which is okay, okay? First of all, I'm going to say it's okay. Let me tell you why. I'm going to give you a little story about my background, okay? I was naive, too. The reason why I was naive is because I'm a high priestess of the light. I had no idea about tarot. I didn't know nothing about um, the difference between tarot. Like my, I use tarot cards, but my tarot cards, my intentions behind the tarot cards are of the Lord God, of high vibration, 
high priestess of the light. I don't deal in any spell work of any kind, okay? No dark work, no rituals, no Reiki, no nothing. No kind of connection of distortion of what God's path is. I don't mess with what I go. I let God guide me. I don't, me, I don't guide myself and do things that I know that I should not be doing, okay? So when it comes down to you being naive and not knowing about spell work and, and how spiritual warfare works is okay. That means that you're of the light. That's why a lot of you guys um, get caught up with karmics by doing these cord cuttings and um, these different rituals and these healing, the, the Reiki healing and stuff like that. And people got mad when I said about Reiki healing, but Reiki healing is, is uh, messing with God's design. If anything distorts God's design, it is what it is, y'all. I'm not, I'm not here to play with you. I'm here to save your life, okay? I'm here to recorrect your path, to, to redirect your path if you are on the wrong path or you don't know if you're naive about something. I didn't know a lot too either. My masculine was with a witch. Her, her mom's a witch. Her, she has a twin sister. She's a witch. Her other sister's a witch. Her sister's a witch. And my masculine's karmic is a witch. That was a coven of five women. And then they grabbed him, made him think that he was actually a part of the coven, but he was actually being worked against with his twin, which is me. They were using him to destroy our connection. That's how serious spell work is when you're naive. They made him feel like he was a part of the coven, but he really wasn't. He was being used the whole time. I was brought in as the high priestess to give him knowledge on that, but he, they had him so wrapped and bound and tied that he didn't believe me. So he had to live he had to live out his karma. Which was rough, which I know is rough because I'm the high priestess, so I know everything that's going on. But it's a lesson that had to be learned. I came in to save him from this heavy lesson, but when you're naive and you don't know and you think you know and you're willing and a lot of times with the masculines, the masculines are setting their ways with the hierophant energy in reverse, refusing to change, not willing to look at anything new. That's how he got caught up in his karmic debt heavier than he should have been. You see what I'm saying? So when it came to me being attacked, I had no idea about spell work. I had a friend that came in and God sent in to teach me about the dark and the light. How to protect myself. How to take care of myself. You guys... When it comes to spell work and these connections, when it comes to divine connections, it's a lot of spell work. A lot of you guys are angry at your person, but you're angry at your person for something that was out of their control. <laughs> Everything's about to come out in, in the open. Your, your, your test is forgiveness. Because if you're a divine connection, you have to love the way God loves you. And it's the lesson here in the situation here. Yep, that's what we got. What is losing um, me was your karma. Yep, for not committing. The punishment. This, when this person let go of you, they let go of God. They went towards the devil, which is why all this happened. Everything I just said, correct? There go God right there. The hierophant in the reverse. I just said that. Whoever this person is, this is a divine connect connection. The person that walked away from you, you were sent in to help them. Why I said higher priests of the light. This person was setting their ways. They, they cared about what, what people thought and what things looked like and image and things like that. And that is what got them caught up in this situation of a lie. Because this whole situation was nothing but entrapment and abuse. Yeah, this is spiritual abuse. What is forgiveness here? Yep. This person wants to heal with you because now they know you're the star. This person knows who you are. And if that couldn't have happened if God would have put you guys through this test. Uh-huh. Yep. Uh, Mesh is coming in. Let me see what that says. It says, um, calling star six, seven. You guys may be getting some unknown calls and people hanging up, Okay. Love bombing messages ready to speak their mind. Unexpected messages. Ten of Pentacles. This person knows who you are. They're ready to come in and build with you. Okay? Whatever they built in this situation has to fall. The four of wands in reverse. So this karmic connection this is a faulty foundation. It was not real from the beginning. It was an illusion. The spell is... is does, uh, everything is falling. That's confirmation. 
four of wands. This karmic probably came off like they were the twin or they were the actual um, divine counterpart. They were not. And it's falling. It was all alive with the page, of, the page of cups in reverse. What's the love message in reverse here? Yep, it was magic. What did I say? What did I say, y'all? I told you. The, the, this situation here, God is real, okay? Like I tell you guys, don't be a fool and believe the hype of what you see because it's not what you think. What you see is not what you're really seeing here. I went through this. I've been there. I'm going to leave that there. What we say? High priestess of the dark. What did I say? Witches. Wounded. Abuse. Witches. Abuse. Karmic. Toxic karmic love. Witches. Your, and if you're the high priestess, your person turned you in reverse. You tried to help this person. You guys resonate with me because a lot of you went through what I went through in order for me to in order for me to heal you and guide you and teach you and grow you and transform you to where God wants you to be. You have to resonate with me. I've been through it all. That's why I'm able to help you. High priestess, of the, I, this is me in the reverse here. This is what I'm saying. What I told you, he chose a toxic love over his true person. He went towards a witch. There you go right there. And you guys resonate. You went through the same thing. This was abuse. This witch was abusing both people. You and your person were being spiritually abused. Your person was naive. They were the hierophant in reverse. They were refusing to see things the way they were supposed to see it. So losing you was their karma because they threw you away. And went towards a, com a commitment here. This person here, they, they left you for, they moved quickly away from you, with this, away from their queen, of, their queen of Pentacles and went into the situation here. This person's leaving this situation ship and they're coming towards you. That's why you're upright. This person was a counterfeit. Mm-hmm. Yep. We have a no. Queen of Cups, Divine Feminine. This person is not repeating the cycle again. They're coming towards you. They're in love with you. They know exactly what they want. They do. Uh-huh. There's no question on this board here. There's no question on this board here. This person knows exactly what they want and who they want and they know what happened. Yeah, they learned a heavy lesson here, but it's been learned. What is the um, losing you was, the, was your karma? Yep, well, the fortune. What did I say? What goes around comes around. This is, this is why we're not... This is why we're not here to make somebody suffer. This is why we're not here to give revenge on someone. Because God handles it. He right here. Losing you was that karma. Lesson learned. Karma. What goes around comes around. What they did to you came back tenfold. <laughs> Yep, the lesson has been learned. That's why this person is desiring you. Because they know the truth. All their feelings and everything is bubbling up because this person here, this false person was suppressing their feelings and reversing it on and making it them. So what your person felt for you, this person tried to flip it into them. They wanted your person to love them. It was all false. What is forgiveness here? Yep. For throwing you away. They're two of cups. I told you. Divine counterparts are twin flames. On this board here. This person. They, they want forgiveness for, for hurting you. For this person. Yep. That is beautiful. What is message. What is um, message come in common? Yep. That this person's not stuck. They're ready to move forward towards you. They've been released from a demon here. Yep. And everybody who's been doing stuff to you guys. Is about to get their karma. What is the four of wands here? Yep. This commitment is ending. This is a false commitment. I told you. This karmic this car using magic to make your person commit. They tried to steal you guys' destiny here. That's why you're upright. And this masculine's in reverse. They were in the wrong commitment. It was conflict magic. They put conflict spells between you two to separate you. And then they, then they honed in on your person to make them commit with love magic and love spells. That's how your person, if they married this person, how they committed it to them. But it was not real. It was a false commitment. It was a forced commitment. Spell work. Love magic. Commit to me magic. Marry me spells. Is what the situation was. This was a witch. A thirsty witch. Mm-hmm. I told you guys. And this person being seen for who they are. Which means nobody going to ever trust them. They're not, they're not going to be able to have another man or woman in their life. This situation is over for this person. This karmic will never have love again. They, never, they didn't have it with your person. Your person always loved you. Queen of Cups. They could not change somebody's heart. Magic does not change the heart. 
the illusion has been dropped. Seven of wands, seven of cups in reverse on top of the witch. Everybody know who this person is here. Yep. This karmic is now being being attacked by what they put out. It's, it's, it came back home to visit. Mm -hmm. That's what it's going to stay. This person will be in mental anguish for the rest of their life. They will not be even mentally stable enough to be in a relationship. Mm -mm. Not all the spell work they did and anybody was the coven here that they had to help them is going is, is with them. Okay, with mental, mental instability, losing their homes, finances, everything crumbling. They will live in karma for the rest of their days for what they did to these connections. What is the chariot here? What did I say? It's going back. Five of swords. This karmic play they sell. Yep. Whoever was involved. Covens, family, friends, anybody that was in on this on this separation between you and your person. All this massive chaos and pain that you guys went through. It's all returned to sender. 14 wands. Eighteen wands. Yep, eighteen wands. One plus eight is nine, which is a karmic ending. What did I say? <laughs> Deception. Line cheating is still coming off like there are you. It's over. What is the will of fortune? Yep. Your person's having major nightmares. This person is freaking out because now they're awake and now they know the truth. Now everything is falling and coming out. Everything that happened that you were trying to save them from as the high priestess, upright, you were you were sent in to help this person because this person, hierophants are very naive, okay? The hierophant is religious. The empress is spirit. I'm, I'm sorry, the, the high priestess is spiritual. The high priestess is the protection for the hierophant. Because this is a power couple. It's a husband and wife. Your job as the high priestess was to, was to protect the hierophant from any warfare that was in the 5D that you can't see. You have to conquer the witches. The only person that can conquer witches is the high priestess of the light. How do I know? Because I did it. That's the only way that you that the only, only way that the that your masculine is going to be protected is by his high priestess. So that's the reason why the things that you guys were telling your people, your your person, if you were if you knew this person, the things you were telling them, you didn't know why you were saying it, but God was giving you the messages to tell this person to protect them, but they were too much caught up in their ego and and being stuck in their ways that they didn't want to hear it. And now this person's going through the karma, the feeling of karma losing you is my karma because this person, this is their karma, they didn't listen. Yeah, you, you were sent in to help them, to con to protect them from what was coming. Yeah. And you got, this person mistreated you, whatever happened to you guys for the reason why you were broken up. Uh, it had a lot to do with spell work, but this person still made bad decisions. Yeah, it's coming back, to, it's, it's all balancing out, y'all. Yep, karma, judgment. They made the wrong judgment. This person had a decision to make between two paths, and they went down the wrong path here. Yep. They went. They took the wrong turn. Mm-hmm. And that judgment is costing this person right now. Everything. They're going through a painful ending here. The one that you tried to avoid them from having. Mm-hmm. And, and it's so bad because you were sent in to help, but they end up lying, cheating, and stealing from you, and trying to one-up you for this false person here. Yeah. Yep, that's what's going on here. But they want to start it over. Page of Pentacles. God is giving you guys an opportunity to restart. This person wants to bring in the Tenth Pentacles. You guys are probably the Nine of Pentacles. If you are not there yet, then you, this, will reckon, this will resonate with you when, it, when you get to the Nine of Pentacles. Uh-huh. If you're already there or at Emperor status, then you're ready. Yep. This person's coming in. Ten of Pentacles. A lot of you guys are about to get your Tenth Pentacle. What is the uh, king, of, king of Coins here? What did I say? It was not wish fulfillment. It was false. The situation was an illusion. And they kept some of these some of these people got caught up in this connection with a black male and a stronghold because of their sexuality. To keep this person stuck in the situation, but it was financial to what they were holding them for. Whoever this person is that got that took that stole your person, this person was a bum. This person was a true life bum. 
this person was a true life bum. When I say a true life bum, what I mean is this person does not like to work. They don't like to do anything but sit on their butt and spend money. This person's entitled. Everything they do is because they want something out of you. It's not because they care about you. They entrapped this person and locked them in with blackmail and deception. Mm-hmm. And the situation's coming full throttle. It's coming full circus. I said circus. That's chaos. It's, it's coming full circle. Yep. Three of Pentacles. What did I say? The coven. It went back to them. If you're, you're the Queen of Pentacles, you're their actual mate. So everything that was sent towards you guys, you guys doing your work or being obedient in your path is causing this coven to be shut down. The coven is shut down. Yes, they are. Mm-hmm. We got some people. We got some people that's about to get some serious karma. Anybody that worked on this connection, who did dark work, even even the practitioners. Mm-hmm. Warlocks, anybody, they they getting it. Mm-hmm. I love being a high priestess of the light. I, when I tell you, an ascending master is the way to go. That's the best. That's that's the most blessed gift I could have ever had. Even more than finances. That's this is the best gift I can ever have. It's my seat I'm sitting in right now. Foolish. Your person was foolish for lying, cheating, and stealing. That's why they're in deep depression. Yeah, they know they went wrong. They know it. What's the hierophant in reverse? Yep. This person's sick. This person is sick and stuck in their head and losing their mind because they know now what your job was. They knew what you were supposed to do. They knew what you were trying to do. Yep. And they made the wrong judgment here because they know now you're the star. They missing you like crazy. They made the wrong decision. And they want their ships to come in and heal with you. This person is praying for deliverance. They're praying for you to have mercy on their soul. Uh-huh. Tower. Situation about to blow. This is about to be a tower moment. It's going to shock the crap out of y'all. This person, this page of pentacles is about to be, this is, the, this is a uh, engagement. It keep coming out. It's a proposal. This person, they, they know they got to come in with it. Page of Wands, upright. Good news. Wow. Whew. Let's see what's going on here. Let's get a little deep in this. What we got? Compromise. Yep. This person debos this person to compromise. Uh huh. They made them. They did. They use spell work to make this person balance uh, compromise with them. Yes, they did. This, this 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 King of Pentacles in reverse is fed up. Your person has been robbed in this connection in any, in every way, spiritually, emotionally, financially. Uh huh. They've been robbed. Secrets coming out. What did I say? This with the with the uh, illusion here. The secrets here. Your person was held. Hold. If this person's bisexual, is childhood trauma. They had two paths. They had a judgment to choose, which was you, or this path here, the devil's path. The devil amplified their wounding. Okay, that's why this person, they know with you, that you're the only person that can help them to heal here. And they're praying for your ships to come in with the tower here proposal because this person knows that they were amplified. But everybody, this person may be looked at in the community that they're in is gay now because their business is out. Mm -hmm. Rejection. This person's afraid you're going to reject them because of the things that are coming out, all the secrets that's coming out here. Yep, and all the magic is being rejected. Anything that's sent by covens or anybody, anybody else who sent magic towards you guys is backfiring. Uh-huh. Yep, that's what we got here. Ghosted. Some of you were ghosted. Your person feels foolish for doing that. Yep, you're twin flame. Person's sick. I told you you guys were twin flames that you're a higher friend and high priestess. Or a just or just a regular twin flame. Emperor and Empress. Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Whatever the suit, because we have different level, different levels and assignments of ascension. Everybody's not a high priestess and emperor. I mean, everybody's not a high pri priestess and I'm um, hierophant. We have different rankings. Twin flame here, but it's a definite twin flame connection. This person is sick over what they did to you, of the foolish decision that they made when they did what they did to you. Mm -hmm. They've been trying to cope here. This person's been having a hard time coping with what they did in this situation. Yeah, they're nervous here. Spiritual warfare in reverse. 
It's all backfiring. That's why this person's wide open and they, and they know what they did and they miss you like crazy. This person's sick without you guys. Yeah, they are. They real sick without you guys here. Give me some more. Yep. There's about to be a major tower moment with this situation. Your person's about to fight for you. My way. Proposal. Yep. Sure is. Karmic ties in reverse. Karmic ties are breaking. A situation is about to end. Let's see what the situation is. Let's get some more tea on um, these people who've been doing stuff here. What, the, what we got going on here? What's the energy of this karmic situation? What's, what's, what's the outcome here when it comes to this person, these people, this coven, these people, practitioners, whoever was working against this connection? What's the outcome here? Yep. Strategy in reverse. It's all backfired. It reversed. What else we got here, Father? Yep. Karma connection. Karma. They will not have any love. Like I said, the love is done. Yep. Love is done. Anybody that was involved, they will not be able to heal. Their deceit has backfired. Deception went right back to them. It's a major reversal. Look at God. God, you are amazing. What else is going on here? Car what did I say? Karma for what? Look at God. Oh, that's what I said. Karma for messing with a twin flame connection. Ain't that what I said? This is major karma. They done. When you mess with a divine, see, God set He set He set these karmics up so that they can be out of the way when the when the unions come back in. Then that way nobody anybody that was against this connection will be removed. Karma. Again, right right side by side. Yep. Your person's still in balance and they're needing to the balance. That's why this person is sick without you. Yep, they're about to take action. And they're walking away from this situation. Yes, they are with a tower coming in to ask you for a proposal. This person here is ready to go towards their path, which is God. Look at that. That's our outcome. Wow, y'all. All right. So we have we are about to head over to the new channel. I mean, I'm sorry, the old channel, the first platform, our first home, okay? We're about to head over to the home channel and do another reading, okay? We're going to do the extended off of that reading, okay? So you guys will be getting, you got, if you're a part of 144K chat membership, you'll be getting a total of four readings tonight. All right now, y'all. Um, I'm happy to be here. I'm excited about what God is doing in my life. I am glad that you guys are part of it with me to walk with me down this journey. Um, I thank you guys for being here and supporting me and loving me like you do. I'm just grateful for both. you guys. I'm, I'm excited about what's ahead because I can't release it until it all unfolds, you know. Um, so I thank you for everything. I'm so happy to be here. I'm happy to have you guys with me on this journey and being here with you to bring you to where I am. And you guys that allow me to do it, I'm, I'm just like excited. Okay. So what we got next, we are about to head over to the, to the, uh, first, our first home. Okay. DAG 717 LLC. Okay. Um, the link is down below if you guys do not have it. And I have both links below. It say new channel and first channel one. ST channel and then new channel okay both links attached okay one under the under the other and then go over there and make sure you subscribe so that you won't miss any things we're doing we're doing eight videos a week you guys will have eight readings plus the four extendeds if you if you guys are with patreon with us if you have not join us okay um the link is on both channels you go into the you go to go down below and you click on whichever channel that you are on you go to the about section you go to the uh, which is the last tab on the channel on a, on our uh, home channel page, whichever whichever channel that you're on, and then you click the about section. Go down, you'll see Patreon link. We have two tiers. The first tier is Tuesday nights. We get one four four K chat membership, and then the um, that's five thirty a month for just that video. Okay. Then we have an extended package, which is the one four four K chat membership plus four video four extended readings a week. Okay. So you get five videos for eleven dollars and eight cents a month. That's the deal, because for only one extended, you're paying about that much. So I give you guys five videos for $11.08 a month on Patreon. Um, I am doing two questions for $15. If you need ASAP, add 10 bucks, and I'll get it to you within 48 to 72 hours for two questions for $25 for emergency, okay? Um, I give back every single month 
three free readings you guys have until the last day of the month to qualify for the month of April, okay? And I'll put it up by the first, first or second week of May, okay? Um, one, you guys must be subscribed to both channels. Two, uh, make sure that you have the, the, the notification bell clicked on for both channels. Three, comment, comment, comment so I can see you. And number four, like if you love me, okay? Um, I am giving back two readings this month. I usually give back one, but a guy told me to discount two this month. You guys have the Raw Truth on sale, regular price, $70. Um, and it's on sale for 56 bucks. The Raw Truth Behind the Situation is any, uh, any information that you would like to know that's hidden behind your back. That's what the Raw Truth reading is. Then we have the second reading on sale, which is a spiritual warfare reading. That's for blockages, um, chakras, um, spiritual warfare, attack, um, <clears throat> warfare between you and God. If there's something he wants you to know, if he's the one that's holding you back, you need to know. That's a very important reading. Um, it's regular price $77.77 or on sale for, 50, for $65. So it's on sale for $65 bucks instead of the last day of the month. Both of those readings come with three bonus questions if you would like them. If not, I can just freestyle, okay? Um, everything else, we have a payment plan for all the readings as well. If you need a payment plan for the special readings, make sure you have the first payment paid, first half of the payment paid by the last day of the month at 11.59 p.m. to be locked in at either the Raw Truth at 56 and the Spiritual Warfare at, at 65, okay? Um, if you guys like a, a payment plan for all other readings below in the platform on the description box, then let me know. Email me and I'll get you set up. Um, all readings can be put in the payment plans except for the emergencies, okay? Anything else I missed, please email me. If you guys would like to bless the channel and give donations to me for my hard work and the love that you have for me, um, if you don't do Super Chat, we also I have PayPal and Cash App, okay? Um, I also have a P.O. Box if you want to send gifts, okay? Uh, that's it. I think that's it for me. If, it's, if I miss anything, let me know. Other than that, I will see you guys over on our home platform divine angelic guidance 717 llc okay we will be going over there now for our second premiere and our extended reading i love you and i will see you guys tomorrow namaste